Major, this is General Garza. I need you to report to my office on Coruscant immediately. General Rapton made his move. The Imperials have invaded dozens of Republic planets. Havoc Squad is needed, immediately. Is there a plan for dealing with this invasion, General? I'll brief you on the details when you arrive. Move quickly. Garza out. Major, stand at ease. Let's get straight to the situation at hand. After we destroy the gauntlet, General Rackton called a diplomatic summit with the heads of state of several Republic allied planets along our borders. The summit was held aboard a neutral space station where Rackton's troops seized the heads of state by force. They are now hostages of the Empire. How does this tie into Rackton's invasion plan? This is Rackton's invasion plan. With their leaders held hostage, our allies are allowing Imperial troops to pass through their systems and strike us where we're vulnerable. Our forces are at their limit. The Imperials will overwhelm us unless we rescue these heads of state and block Rakton's invasion routes. No hostages are worth allowing an invasion, no matter how important they are. I agree, but this is the situation we are presented with. Let them die isn't the solution our allies want to hear. The station where the heads of state are being held is called Outpost 256. Imperial security is tight, but we've developed an entry plan. Helic, a diplomat for one of these worlds, is flying there to surrender his government's security codes. He's volunteered to sneak your team aboard. I don't like relying on a diplomat with no combat experience. There are no other options. Time is critical. And Helic is an opportunity we can't afford to pass up. Your ship will ride alongside Helix, detaching at the last second and landing in an unused maintenance hangar aboard the station. Lieutenant Yoon will slice into the station's security and stop any alarms from sounding while you storm the crew area and secure the hostages. Understood? Those fat bureaucrats will be back in their palaces in no time. These are valued allies of the Republic, Major. Try to show them some respect. Helic will rendezvous with you at these coordinates. The Imperials are expecting him to deliver his security codes very soon, so move quickly. Remember, the safety of the Republic depends entirely on the safety of these men. Good luck.
Uh, hello? Are you there? H Havoc Squad, is that you? We're here, Halleck. Feeling a bit nervous? Yes, yes, yeah, you could say that. I'm not exactly trained for situations like this. You've done this sort of thing before, right? Rescuing hostages? I really don't know anything about you. You're not supposed to know any details about us. We're special forces. Oh, yes, yes, of course. My apologies. The people of Aquella truly appreciate what you're doing for us. I, I'm sure the citizens of all the worlds affected by this situation do, too. You're risking your life for leaders you've never met, and I, I thank you. I need those leaders alive because it makes the Republic safer. Even so, you're doing our citizens an incredible favor. We, we won't forget it. I'm going to set a course for Outpost 256 now. Uh, good luck, Major. Slow down and start over.
Sir, there are matters we should discuss privately the next time we return to our ship. Time to do some damage. Who the... public soldiers? Major! Oh, it's such a relief to see you. Is the plan working? Is everything going all right? The station systems are in our control. I'm heading for the hostages now. That's fantastic. Why didn't you tell us there was a rescue mission going on, Helic? We could pitch in. I'm ready to get some payback. That doesn't seem wise. We would probably just get in the way. L let's leave this to the professionals. Head for the maintenance section. My squad will keep you safe there. Oh, really? Thank you, Major. I guess it beats staying locked up in here. Good luck, Major. We all owe you big time. made a wise choice. Embracing the Imperial way of life will bring prosperity and security to your floundering worlds. Thank you, General. You've given us a great opportunity, and we appreciate it. Indeed. It's unfortunate that your colleagues couldn't be persuaded to... Guards! Security breach! Engage Protocol 2-7 immediately! It's funny us bumping into each other like this, General. I'm sure you can explain what you mean from the inside of an Imperial prison cell. Guards, execute.
are you? I'm the one who blew up that big, expensive toy of yours. I should have known. Who else would storm in but the one responsible for this unfortunate situation? You will face justice for what you've done. My men's sacrifice will be avenged, and the Emperor's justice will be served. We're saved. The Republic has saved us. Thank you. Thank you. Shut your mouth, traitor. You don't even deserve to breathe the same air as the rest of us. These cowards were signing up with Rakton. They traded their planets to the Empire in exchange for lifetime leadership positions. Betrayed the Republic, huh? That wasn't very nice of you. We... we had to. We must be loyal to our people first and foremost. Their lives are our responsibility. Don't hide behind your people. You gave up. You betrayed everything that we fought for. Alliances we've all held for generations. We are at war. We don't have room for cowards or traitors. You deserve to be executed. Agreed. Give these traitors what they deserve. If anyone asks, we'll say the Imperials murdered them. This is what happens when you betray the Republic. Thus to all traitors, long live the Republic! We are at war with the Sith Empire. We cannot waste time on cowards or traitors. Can we get off this miserable station now? Where's my man, Helic? Did he ever turn up? Your man snuck my team aboard. Thank him for your rescue. Yoon, come in. Operation complete. Bring the ship up to the crew area and drop Helic and the others off. We owe you our lives, soldier. The Republic has proven how much it values us as allies. It's time we return the favor. Tell your leaders that starting now, no Imperial will set foot on our worlds without paying in blood. Long live the Republic! Long live the Republic! Major, stand at ease. It's good to see you again. Welcome back. You remember Supreme Commander Rands. We were reviewing the results of your mission. You did an excellent job on Outpost 256. Congratulations. Rakton was on the hollow when I rescued the heads of state. Good. Let him see what you're capable of. Let him wonder when it will be his office that you're blasting your way through. It's unfortunate that the Imperials executed Premier Vaughn and Archduke Kaler. 
They were both very popular with their people. We've ensured their people will remember them as heroes who died defying the Empire. Their memory will set the example for their citizens. As soon as they heard what happened on Outpost 256, our allies began full-scale strikes against the Imperials in their territories. We've won a major victory, but the war is just beginning. Your squad will be playing a vital role in our campaign against Rakton. With a record like mine, you get used to the big ops. Right now, we need every advantage we can get. Every available force must be put to work to counter the Empire's moves. Some of our top military units are bogged down on backwater planets instead of serving on the front lines where they belong. Havoc Squad is going to get our top forces where they need to be, starting with a group of elite pilots trapped on Belsavis. Understood? Can you give me any intel on Belsavis, General? We'll discuss the details once you've arrived in orbit. Our forces are still spread thin. Saving our allies has relieved some pressure. But to turn the tide, we need every advantage we can get. We will not accept defeat at the hands of the Empire. We will defeat them, utterly and completely. Time to find out what medal they hand out for winning a war. Welcome home, Master. I hope you find your vessel a model of efficiency, convenience, and comfort. Good news, sir. Dorn's giving me a clean bill of health. I'm free to get back to work right away. Don't push yourself if you aren't feeling up to it. Are you kidding? I'm dying to get out there and stretch my legs. No need to worry about me, sir. Let's get to it. 